Hello everyone. Every once in a while a special film comes on and whether you like it or hate it it makes you ponder, stirs you in every conversation and stays with you long after viewing. Here is the list of 10 movies which you should check out at least once in your lifetime. Number 10 Fight Club. Fight Club is a movie based on a novel by Chuck Palahniuk. If you look at the movie through the surface then you will only find bare-chested men fighting with each other. But when you see through the philosophical view of the movie there is much more about men beating the crap out of each other. This movie has managed to be philosophical and thrilling at the same time. It is all about how people have succumbed to their falsities of the world and even offered their soul to different enterprises of the world. Number 9 A Beautiful Mind A Beautiful Mind is an American drama based on the life of John Nash, a Nobel laureate in economics. The movie begins with John Nash graduation days at Princeton University and continues to his wanderings in his examination of certain intriguing areas. As the movie proceeds, we can see the toil of John Nash with to achieve what he has always dreamt of and also at the same time fighting with the disease schizophrenia. It shows love as an omnipotent weapon that can overcome and release one who is suffering from delusions and make them return to their senses. Number 8, A Space Odyssey. If you are a fiction freak, then this is the best movie to watch. It deals with lots of heavy concepts like human evolution, technology, existentialism, artificial intelligence, etc. It opens up the audience for their ideology to interpret the movie. It can be viewed as a four-part movie. Part 1, The Dawn of Man. Part 2, The Space Age. Part 3, Jupiter Mission. Part 4, Beyond the Infinite. There is very minimal use of dialogue. The visual effects shown in the movie are groundbreaking and all the technology shown in the movie is impressive. You would be blown away by all these awesome technologies. Number 7, Shawshank Redemption. The Oscar nominated dark drama starring Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman is a must watch movie. The script on a jailbreaker brilliantly combines realism and allegory, something we can rarely find. It has made an undeniable connection with the audience. They have conveyed the message of adapting and acceptance. It very well explains hope than any modern dictionaries. This is one of the powerful movies to watch. Number 6, Cinema Paradiso. An Italian drama story is directed by Giuseppe Tornatore. This is a really beautiful movie to watch. The audience connects with this movie at a personal level as if the director cast us, the viewers as the protagonist. So we experience the movie first hand. It touches our soul and we do not want to let it go. We desperately try to cling on the temporary things, but also all things come to an end and this film too. It aesthetically intertwines a cine junkie's passion with an unobtrusive and powerful explanation of brief present, classic romance and post-war scenes in a very glorious way. Number 5, Batman Dark Knight. A superhero movie based on the DC Comics character Batman is a sequel to Batman Begins starring Christian Bale. This movie won't make you bored even for a single time. It hooks you up from the beginning to the end and does not even disappoint you in the end. It is not a simplistic tale of good and evil. You will be stunned by the performance of late Heath Ledger as the Joker. If people thought Batman Begins is something new then, they quickly forget in the initial 20 minutes of the movie. The Dark Knight consistently interconnects various diverse activity motion picture subkinds, thrillers, crime films, detective stories, etc. and still figured to regard them all and take central plot seriously and above all less its primary character was batman number 4 saving private ryan this is an american epic war film which was set during the invasion of normandy in world war 2 if you do not know much about what world war 2 looked like then saving private ryan will give you a pretty good idea it is a movie that tells you a war story and in the battle scenes looking back onto a feeling of unforgiving reality with brutality and the passing of numerous warriors the cinematography is outstanding It captures a war that is both dark and on account of D-Day unbelievable. Once in a while, do most movies capture a spirit of war that is frightening and also beautiful without extolling the war or its warrior. Number 3, The Shining. The Shining is a horror movie directed by Stanley Kubrick which is based on the novel 
ది షైనింగ్ ది మూవీ ఇస్ అనదర్ ఛాన్స్ టు అప్రిషియేట్ మోస్ట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్లీ దోస్ హెవెన్లీ ఇంటీరియర్ సెట్స్ రాదర్ దాన్ ది కన్ఫైండ్ హేసీనస్ అండ్ ప్యానికీ క్విక్ ఎడిటింగ్ ఆఫ్ ది స్టాండర్డ్ ఇష్యూస్ క్యారీ మూవీ కుబ్రిక్ గివ్స్ అ ది స్పూకీ ఎపిక్ స్ప్లెండెడ్లీ లిట్ స్పేస్ ఆఫ్ ది ఓవర్లుక్ హోటల్ షార్ట్ విత్ ఆప్లిట్యూడ్ అండ్ కామ్ ఇట్ వుడ్ సీమ్ దట్ అ రిలింక్విస్ట్ సిటీ or the state rooms supernaturally undamaged at the base of the sea there is unadulterated motivation just in the scene in which young danny rides his bicycle around the endless corridors the movie is going to give you some goosebumps number 2 the godfather trilogy one of the highest grossing film of 1972 is a crime film based on a novel the godfather by an american author mario puzo It cast the story of a fictional mafia family in New York City who fights a mob war with other four mafia families in New York after World War II. This movie taps into both the gangster myth as well as the immigrant myth. The movie is a portrait of a family with lots of sibling love and rivalries and also a portrait of America as a nation of immigrants fighting for power and legitimacy. Before we get on to the number 1 film in our list please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video thank you for your support number 1 Schindler's List based on a novel Schindler's Ark by an American novelist Thomas Kinelli is an epic historical drama that cast Liam Neeson as Oscar Schindler a Sudetenland German businessman who was rich and saved many lives of Jews during World War 2 Before the World War he was a hard drinker and a very rich businessman and after the war he failed in both his marriage and business and during the holocaust a mysterious grace falls upon him and he becomes concerned for the jews and decides to save as many of them he saves from the corrupt german officials by buying them under the guise of procuring cheap labor for his enamelware factory the real lesson and the beauty of the story lie in the seamless transition of this man from a money minded businessman to a big supporter of the jews and finally into a sensitive man who actively saves the jews from the germans that's it from us today we will meet you in another video with a very interesting topic